Hey everybody and welcome back to Freedom to Paint with me, Ronnie Falco. Welcome to my studio. Alright, today's episode I'm going to be showing you how to use acrylic poster markers to draw a bride-to-be um, on Bristol board. So, beautiful bride. And the cool thing about um, acrylic poster markers is you, they can be very opaque or transparent. First thing you want to do is grab a couple um, flesh tone colors. So you can have pink, yellow, brown, um, all different kinds. And the cool thing is you can start blending the colors. So start laying them down. Let me, uh, let me rip this page off so I can get more expressive. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, and then you can start blending them together to make cool colors. All right. Drag, drag some other colors in, and this will give you a true um, complexion. It'll be um, multi-dimensional. If I just use one color, um, it wouldn't it wouldn't be as accurate. I'm going for more a photorealistic approach in this episode. Okay, so you can see they're starting to blend together. There's a little shaker. You can shake these up, and then drop more ink. I got a little cheat sheet here um, of a woman so I, I can draw more accurately. Now I'm gonna come in with the hair. So I'm gonna drop some hair in. Okay, get some nice flowing hair. Um, sometimes brides will wear their hair in a bun so they can put the that mosquito netting stuff over it a little more easily, it doesn't get tangled up. Now what I want to do is drag in some white. Okay, so I bring the white in for the eyeballs. Um, you want to come in with two nostril holes. Use black because the nostril hole is pretty deep. And then I want to use pink and red for the lips. So there, I started with pink, that way I don't have to commit to something if I want to change it. And now I'm going to come in with lipstick on top of that. Nice big smile on wedding day. And then I'm going to come in with some eye shadow on the top and bottom. And now the eyeball. So these markers are a lot of fun. Now this one's dried out. Can't use that one. I'm going to drag some more colors in. I've got green and blue. And see how I did that? I didn't actually draw all the way in. I left it so it looks like there's a little bit of reflection. Now I'm going to bring in the pupil. And then on top of that, watch this. You can just gently kind of drag through like a little reflection. Okay, this looks pretty realistic. Last thing you want to do, make sure this is good and dry. is draw the, the, the neck line and then the dress. The markers kind of dry it out. And now the last thing I want to do is the veil. So it's very transparent. So I can just drag all the way down like this and draw the veil. So it looks like the, uh, the netting and you can still see the face through it. All right, last thing I'm gonna do is sign it. Always wanna sign your work. There you have it, bride to be. I'm Ronnie Falco, thanks for watching the episode using acrylic poster markers to draw a bride to be.